Hey guys, it's Jacksbar123, and today we are on the Gaming Evolved modded ARC server. And in the last episode, we set up our farm and we got C1, Z only, Rocky. Rocky is a prime dire bear that summons an even bigger dire bear when I press C, and he has a lot of damage. I leveled him up to max and stuff, but today, you might notice I have no tool bore. That's just a bug. But we are doing this. We come here. We go bang, 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 bang. And now, Mega Evolve. <laughs> Again, it scared the crap out of me. We're Mega Evolving Arnold, our one and only friend, into a grand creature. A creature all things fear. A giant dimorphodon. Oh gosh, it's so cool again. Oh, here it is. This is our dimorphodon. And he just died. Rip. No, I'm just toying with you guys. This. This is our pet. This is Arnold's true form. It's like wishy washy. Let's name him Arnold. Change name Arnold. And here we have it. Whoa! My normal attack is a fireball? I'm like a sniper. It's like little mini nukes. How? Do I have any other abilities? No. Shooting fireballs is really strong in its own. Look at that base damage. And let's take that. Increase that HP a bit. Increase that melee damage. Okay. Arnold is now a beast. Hopefully it doesn't have friendly fire. Flying targets are going to be a pain. Until they land. Then we do a lot of damage. Oh gosh, this is so cool. 59,000 damage. Wow. I'm uh, quickly let Arnold heal up and I'll be back in a second. Okay, you guys, we're back. Arnold is now at full HP. And look at this. Look at this mayhem I can cause. Let's see how much damage my melee attack is. Not a lot. I thought I would have had a different attack depending on how close I was. Oh, I wish I had the stat bar showing. But I kind of don't. Because I broke it. I'm like exploding pretty much. I'm shooting nukes. Let's increase that damage. Oh boy. Those barely hit. Oh my gosh. This isn't even max damage and it's like 1 million. I see why they're hard to get. Wow. Just wow. Look at it. It's like a flying artillery. 
I don't think it does friendly fire. Hopefully it doesn't. Let's test it. I tamed this guy solely for that purpose. Die. Wow. Look at Arnold now. Arnold is a beast. He's like a dragon. Let's test him on a Quetza if we can find one. Here's one. Okay, so I just have to right click when I get close. I love his coloring. Another purple. Purple dinosaurs really love me. I guess it's because it's my YouTube color. Bark, bark. You heard it first. Molly Dog does not like sounds. Wow, I just can't get over this damage. Let's increase the movement speed a little bit because I find I'm a little slow. <laughs> I love the hit marker. Hit marker was definitely a must. Wow. This thing is probably able to take on any prime. Just flying over top, just kind of shooting down. Bang, bang, bang. I'm literally shooting nukes. Let's find a... There's an apex. Why can't I fly? Stamina? Okay. Let's pump some stamina on him. See that food? Now it's low. Now it's not. I love how he doesn't have an eating animation. I find the eating animations are just a pain. Okay. There's a Bronto. Let's test him on the Bronto next. A baby Castro. Poor baby beaver. Oh, he's so strong. I'm a BRB when I get the toolbar back up and working. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. Okay, you guys, we are finally back. You might notice here is me. What happened was I had to, well, make a new character. Because issues are big and so is Arnold Arnold is very big let's uh disable victim gathering on him we don't want that happening anymore at least he got some meat um anyways so we can finally see my toolbar again and we can see Arnold's head and we can still see Arnold's damage and his HP and stamina you know all of the important stuff so, pretty much Lee, another thing I wanted to check out was how much, uh, how much HP did the champion bear have that we summon? I figured it would have been a lot or something. Like good HP. Not bad. So, let's quickly look at Rocky. Press C. As the game legs like mad. And this is a bear prime champion. Whatever you want to call it. It has pretty good stats. Not bad. But not the best. And if we look at Arnold. Arnold is a complete and utter beast. And my dog just came over. Ignore the background noises please please. Um... Let's take this off of him. And now he looks super cool without the red hair coloring. And let's put it on Arnold and see what Arnold looks like with it. 
Remote use. Ooh. This I like. Okay, what's ruining? Okay, so I guess I have to normal. At close range, you want the right click. Let's see if we can shoot into the water. Yep. No issue shooting anywhere with this. Um, what else could we do? Let's test his uh, damage without. Okay, not bad damage, but I can see he's not made for close range. He does a lot of damage. I don't even notice the increase on the like damage when I have him with the whichever it's called, whatchamacallits. Okay, let's get rid of that stupid parasaur. And take off this antinode. Because I'm pretty sure there's another way to upgrade him. Let's increase some more HP. Let's go right about here and increase more melee. I didn't see his attack damage go up when I had him with it. Also, I think my Rocky slash Dire Bear would use it much better. Because he is not un like godly this is godly because you need to kill a mega rex now i did see one off cam and i did kill it i couldn't get my recording software working well i did have it working i recorded me killing it but the footage got deleted not deleted it got corrupted is what i should have said let's uh test his damage again not bad. Not 79. <laughs> and let's shoot the Rexes. T Rex on the. Okay, now. Why was that thing running from. That was weird. I never expected to see something as small as a uh, macho tops ma machops chasing a aloe not aloe what are on a carno now we have a lot of melee damage <laughs> let's see how quickly we kill that wyvern there now this wyvern could 100% kill us Okay, well, I didn't mean to hit that. They're like rockets that I'm shooting. Can I not hit it? Let's just leave it. I give up. Just kill these things. 3,049k is a lot of damage. Let's uh fly over. Oh gosh, lots of bad stuff in this sky. Oh yeah, lots and lots of bad stuff. Worst part is this guy is really slow. Um, I know it will only take one shot to kill anything in the sky. Um, does he get close? Oh, he landed. Or went in for a landing. All it takes is one shot and he's dead.
I could probably just aggro it on me and shoot down at the ground. Like this, pretty much. Just flying around being a moving artillery. Did I just get hit? Yes, I did. That's a lot of damage if no one understands modded damage. Let's go there, increase a little bit into movement speed. This should be a lot better. Oh yeah. I think I could at least outfly a, uh, a dragon if I do right maneuvers. And when I say right maneuvers, I mean like going like this. The turning radius on this guy is insanely good. I expected him to have a C ability, but I guess not. Shooting down into the ocean. Aw, uh, do they explode on impact in the water? No? Yes? Kind of? So, while I'm just flying around, I do have some updates, like good news update wise. I'm getting a new router that should increase my internet speed, so that means I might be able to stream or something like that. You know? That is an end goal to be able to stream so that you guys can just be inside of the chat and be like, hey, and I'll be like, hey, and then lots of fun stuff. Or at least be able to do something like stream. Okay, now I do know that there is a big Harambe around here somewhere. And I think we can kill it. I should have brought the antinode. <laughs> oh well. Now where is this Harambe? I do know there's a little cheeky technique to finding them. Since they are always rendered in, like as if they were a player, you can just fly up into the sky and they'll be visible, but I don't want to do that. I won't find the Harambe the normal way. Okay, one Rex, one Rex. Any more Rexes? There's another Rex. Another Rex. Anything else? There's a dra- oh, that's a Manticore. I do know there's a dragon around here somewhere. I could probably kill it. Killing it. But I don't want to kill it. Because it could lay an egg. And eggs are good. Oh, there's titanosaurs that spawn around here. Let's take one of them out. Increase melee damage even more. Okay, let's go in for a little landing. Because he has pretty bad stamina. We'll have to work on that. Let's... No sea ability while on the ground. Just a normal chomp. We'll... Ha Wait, he's already named Arnold. Oh, wow. That was a really easy kill. All I have to do is, like, three fireballs. Two fireballs, pretty much. Let's see how many it takes on this. Oh gosh. I thought that was a uh, mega. That was a prime. Zombie wyverns coming. Oh no, we don't want to deal with that. 
Uh, zombie wyvern. Did it spawn? Did I get the head even? Yeah, I got the prime mega zombie wyvern head. He wasn't even a zombie wyvern though. I'm confused. Let's get uh, 20,000 and we'll stop there. Get some more melee damage. And turn up the gamma. Now let's just kind of test the damage. That wyvern was pretty tough if it took four fireballs. <laughs> Only four though, nothing more, nothing less. Let's find a Carno or something here. Boop. Bop da boopy. That has to be a star. There we go. And that's how you take out a prime RG. Mega Compy, rip. Okay, what's after us? Okay, and now we cleaned out this little section. Let's uh, nothing good, darn it. Let's um. Look around. Takes a little look and see what we can find. Cause this guy is really strong. Let's increase uh, movement speed to 50. There we go. And the rest will be in melee damage. I know I'm having FPS issues. I do plan on fixing that in the future. But till then, that's going to be all for this episode. If you enjoyed, please be sure to comment down below what was your favorite part and let me know what I should do in the next episode. I'll see you guys then. Bye!